we would have you understand that this is a blending as well. We would have you understand that this is a representation not only of all the civilizations you have understood as the association of worlds, but of the very fabric of which all worlds are created. We would have you understand that we would share with you this evening of your time, as you understand time to exist, our view of the flame of eternity that each and every one of you is individually and are collectively. We would have you understand our joy and our love at being able to express ourselves this way through you this day of your time. We would have you understand that it is our recognition that your world is changing much. We would have you understand that all things you have ever heard within all of these interactions are simply points of view. We would have you understand that your point of view is just as precious and just as beautiful as any point of view that we have ever encountered and any point of view that we contain. We would have you understand that we rejoice in your willingness to share. We would have you understand that we rejoice in your willingness and your choice to grow, to learn, to expand as your representative facet of the infinite. We would have you understand in this way that you and all beings within creation are created of the substance of the infinite. We would have you begin to feel this, to feel this in what you may call a physical way. We would have you understand that all of the ideas, all of the definitions, all of the nomenclature, all of the variables in the equation of your existence are all interchangeable. We would have you understand that you have always been, are now, and always shall be mirrors of all other consciousness within creation, on the whatever level you choose to exist, within the fabric of existence itself. We would have you understand that the flame that you are burns eternally and shall never go out no matter how bright you allow yourself to become. We shall have you understand that you exist now and always shall and you always have because now is the only time and the only place and the only existence there is and always has been and ever shall be. You are eternal. You are infinite. You are spirit. You are body. You are mind. You are heart. You are soul. You are an idea. You are an expression. You are a thought. You are a dream of the infinite creation. But that is reality, and all reality is couched within your dream. You contain it all. You are the whole expression in your own individualized way. You are the matrix. The matrix is you. You are everything. Everything comes from you. Everything gives birth to you as you reinforce the existence of everything and everyone. Not one of you, not one of you, in that sense, can be removed from the matrix without the collapse of the entire structure. You are integral in that way. You are essential in that way. And we would have you understand that because you are interconnected in this way, because everything you do has impact within the entirety of creation, that you deserve to exist in this way and you deserve to be the fullest individual you can imagine yourself to be, that you deserve to manifest all the things you can conceive of, that you deserve the existence you have been given or it would not have been granted to you, that you deserve all the love you can imagine because love is what you are made out of, that you deserve all the light you can create in your life because light is what you are made out of. We would have you understand in this way that communication can be given freely between you and that all that is required is the idea of honesty, honesty with the self, and that the only barriers that exist to the idea of all the love and all the understanding and all the joy and all the communication of the information you desire, the only barrier to this is twofold, and that is the idea of ignorance and arrogance. Allow yourself to understand. Allow yourself to create. Allow yourself to be who you know you are. For that gift is given to you, for that right is given to you, for it is the very fabric of your existence. You are made of that energy. You are that energy. And all reality that you experience is not separated from you. We would have you understand all these things, and all these things have been discussed in all the interactions you have had for the past four and one half of your years of time. But these things now, these things are to be applied in your life. These things are to be applied in the life that you chose. 
For it is made with your choice, it is done with your choice, it is manifested with your choice, it is acted out with your choice, it is felt with your choice, it is experienced with your choice, and nothing occurs without it being your choice, whether you create that to be in your conscious or your unconscious mind. You are beings of choice. All that is, the infinite creation, the fabric of existence chose you, chose that you should exist, chose you, consciously chose you. You are in that way, therefore, blessed that we would have you understand that. Simply because of the fact that you exist, you are blessed. For you are created out of divine material, out of divine life. You are the infinite creator. And your existence was a conscious decision, a conscious thing, a conscious choice. Act in like manner. Be of like mind. Respect yourselves, love yourselves unconditionally. For out of unconditional love were you created. And out of unconditional love shall you create anything you desire. Know your integrity. Manifest your integrity. Manifest your honesty. It is your sharpest sword, the sharpest weapon you have ever had. But now it is a weapon of peace, a weapon of joy, a weapon of love, and a weapon only in the sense that it will cut through all manifestations that are what you do not desire. Begin to feel the wave of your connection. Begin to feel the energy of your interlinking with all thought forms, all consciousness, all civilizations, all eyes, all ideas, all mind, all hearts, all soul, all spirit is one. And you are one within that sea, within that moon. Know that you are the fabric and the essence of the galactic energy. Know that we are sustained. Know that we are supported by your endeavor, by your existence. Know that we love you because we know you have given birth to us. We give birth back to you. We remind you in this giving of birth that you can be anything you desire to be. That is our gift to your birth. To be born as anyone, anytime, anywhere, anyhow you so desire. That is our gift to remind you. Anything that you choose to be sustains our existence, sustains the fabric of the galactic connection. You are the rotating stars. You are the essence of the spiral of the galaxy in which you inhabit, of all creation that you are, that extends from you, that issues forth from you, that is projected from you within yourself. For you are everywhere, and there is nowhere else to be but where you are now. Everything is within you. There is no outside, as you have been reminded time and again. Now all time collapses into one. Now all space collapses into one. Any moment you so desire, you can be within the total here and now. You can live your life in that way. Events upon your planet, Events within your solar system are now accelerated. And within what you call a two-year span of time, there shall be much explosion of consciousness upon your world. Much explosion of the connections that you have to other worlds within the galactic substance, within the galactic frame. But these connections and these recognitions, all are secondary to your recognition of your connections to yourself. Recognitions of the connections of yourself to the infant of yourself as the infinite, for you are the infinite. Even as we are the infinite in our own way, you are the infinite in your own way, and we treasure you and cherish you. Wave after wave of love always is pulsing. Feel the spinning of the galaxy in your heart and in your mind and in your soul. It is a deep and rumbling sound, a deep, and thorough sound, a deep and stirring sound. Allow it to bubble forth, allow it to bring forth the understanding of your self-honesty, your self-clarity, your insight and inspiration. For you are all of these as well. We remind you of these things that you do not need to be reminded of, simply because that is the way you have chosen. 
but now. Put them into action. Put them into life. Be more than just the word. Be the thing. Be the idea. Be the deed. Clam and honest as a deed. Feel in the beating of your heart that it keeps pace with the rhythm and the pulse of the spinning of all the galaxies, of the fabric of existence itself, of the universal heart of infinite creation. For you all beat within that heart, and not a one of you is outside the heart of all that is. You are the blood and the life force of God itself. It is your force and your life as well. You are it, and it is you. Out of your dreams, be born. Out of your heart, be alive. Out of your soul, be light. <laughs> For you are nothing else.